Hey there guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Chef with Melcy. I've got some prawns here that is nicely deveined and has been washed with a lemon juice. I've got some paprika. I've also got some garlic, some Old Bay. I've got some Maggie fish seasoning and I've also got some jerk seasoning. I've got some unsalted butter. I'll be using a quarter of the pack. I've got a fresh lime that I'll be using the juice from that. Some Parmesan. I've got some spaghetti and any brand will do. And of course, I've got some Chardonnay, white wine. So any white wine as well, if you have that, will do. Going in with my paprika first, and I'm using a teaspoon of all the seasoning that I'll be using today. Some garlic granules. Old Bay. I've also got some fish seasoning as well. And of course, my Dunn's River jerk seasoning. And that's about a tablespoon and a half of jerk seasoning. Give that a nice little mix and set that aside for about two minutes to marinate. Making sure you coat all those prawns because you want that prawns to be sitting in absolute goodness. And that's what this mix is. Goodness. Love it. So though they're nicely coated, I'm just going to pop that to the side for about two minutes while it's marinating. So whilst that's marinating, I've gone into my skillet here with a quarter of the butter that I showed you and that's unsalted butter. I'm just gonna allow this to melt. And once it's nicely melted, then I'm gonna start adding my prawns. Lovely, so these are going in guys. And I tell you, oh my goodness, the smell just from the first prawn hitting the oil is just intense, just absolutely amazing. So all my prawns are in. I'm just gonna allow that for about three minutes to just be on one side. And then that's three minutes has passed. I'm just going to flip these over quickly. fabulous and guys this smells so good my goodness this smells so good so in goes my lemon juice my lime juice lime juice if you've got lemon by all means use it as well and i'm now adding my chardonnay guys i tell you i'm creating this amazing sauce for your pasta because you don't want any dry pasta right going in now with my parmesan wonderful and again it depends on how much you want Yes, I love Parmesan, so I'm going to add a lot. My pan's nicely boiling there with some water, and I've added salt, and I'm going in with my spaghetti. That's nicely cooked. Spaghetti takes about eight to nine minutes. Once that's cooked, you want to take it straight from the pan and straight into that goodness. Oh, my goodness, guys. And you want to mix it all in. Yes, guys. Mix it all in. All of that juice. Look at that. Absolutely amazing. Yes, we want our sauce to be quite saucy so our pasta is not dried out. No, we do not want any dried pasta. Absolutely amazing. And guys, look at that. I'm just going to sprinkle on my fresh parsley as usual there, guys. And this is absolutely amazing. Another 30 minutes. You've been telling me that you need these 30 minutes quick, easy meal when you come home from a long day. You don't want to have to stand in the kitchen for hours. Look at that. Look at that guy. Oh, look at those prawns. Absolutely amazing, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Delivering another 30 minutes quick meal for the whole family. Thanks for watching. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thanks for subscribing. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. And look at that. 
I will see you in my next video. Guys, look at that. Look at the prawns. Look how juicy that is. Quick and easy. Oh, yes. Bye, guys. Bye.